Hi, I'm Gordon Lustig. We're going to work on Diary Today by David Gates. This is Off the Record. Welcome to Off the Record. We're going to be working on Diary today, as I mentioned, and uh, let's just jump right into it. Let's start with just the fretting hand chord shapes. Our first chord is a small G major 7. I use my second and third fingers, so my first finger is available for the next chord, which is a G7 sus4. It's hard to tell from this screenshot, but I'm only using my first finger for both strings. You could use your first and second if it's easier. The next chord is a C with a G in the bass, otherwise known as C over G. Next is a G major chord. David Gates plays it this way with his thumb on the sixth string, third fret. The song then repeats the first four chords again. G major 7, G7 sus4, C over G, and that G major chord with the thumb on the sixth string. Next we have an E diminished 7 chord, a G over D, a good old fashioned D7, then a B7 with a D sharp in the bass. You can play a regular B7, we just don't play the fifth string in this particular picking pattern. Next we have an E minor with your pinky on the first string, third fret, followed by a one finger G7 with a D in the bass. The very next thing you're going to play is the sixth string, third fret, that low G. So if you'd rather have that down there when you go to the G over D, have your ring finger on that note, that's fine too. Next is a standard C chord, followed by a four finger G chord. The chord shape will stay the same when we pick G over B. Then we play a standard D major chord. We then return to our B7 over D sharp, E minor with the pinky on the first string again, our one finger G7 over D, C again to A minor 7, D major again. Then we have this D over C, which is going to take a little bit of practice. You can play it with your pinky on the 5th string, 3rd fret, or you can bar the first 3 strings in the 2nd fret with your 1st finger. Put your 3rd finger on the 2nd string, 3rd fret, and use your middle finger for the bass note, the C on the 5th string, 3rd fret. You'll have to just experiment. Then we're back to a G over B. Then with the pinky taken off and the second finger added to the first string, second fret, we have G major 7 over B. As we come up to the end of the verse, we have C, and we end the verse on this B7 sus4, just two fingers. The only chord we haven't covered is the second to the last chord in the song which is a one finger C over D. Don't play it like my hand in the screenshot. I've just got my fingers opened up so that you can see my first finger and it's not blocked. Diary is a really fun song to play. It's not that hard. The chords are all pretty accessible. He picks with just his fingers doesn't look like any thumb pick or finger picks. And um, whereas I tend to 
do like if I'm on a G chord, I might go thumb, thumb, fingers. So like um. Third string, fourth string, I might go thumb, thumb, thumb. And he tends to use his thumb more on the fourth and sixth string and use his index finger on the third and his other two fingers on the first two strings. So it'd be like index finger, pluck, no thumb, and then But we'll get into that more in depth right now. tricky going from here. To here, you put your thumb here and play the little little chord. Here's the whole thing again. Three and four. David Gates tends to play with his finger, index finger, rather than his thumb, whereas I'll go thumb, fingers. He tends to go index finger, then middle and uh, ring finger. Then he'll save his thumb. chord three and four and the X is there so that I can make the transition it just means you're kind of just not playing on that last and beat one two and three and four and that's when you're moving and then to the G over D Seven. E minor. Let's do that again. The E minor to the G seven. With your pinky down. So it's going three and four and. play a full G chord. C. Back to G. So this G, you're playing with the two fingers down, pinky on the first string, ring finger on the second string, and you also have your first finger on the fifth string, so it's that full. 
and it's going like this. I'll do that again. And then similar to what we did earlier, going to the B7 over D sharp, but this is just D instead of D7. So three and four and. Then E minor. Our one finger G7 over D. C to A minor seven. Okay, then we have the D to the D over C. And that's a little bit tricky, getting to that fifth string, third fret. So you have the D. And then you could reach your pinky over to the fifth string, third fret, and go. The next note's going to be open because we're moving to the other chord, and so we need to get that transition. Or you could do the D over C like this. Here's D. You could bar with your first finger the three strings in the second fret, ring finger on the second string, and um, put your middle finger on the fifth string, third fret. It takes a little bit more pressure, but you know, do what's comfortable for you. So here's the D. Then we just lift up our pinky and our middle fingers just hanging out ready to play the first string second fret that G major 7 over B. So I'll do that measure again G over B to G major 7 over B. Here it is again without stopping. to C. Again, the C. Three and four and. And this B7 sus, which is going to return us back to the next verse, goes like this. Three and four and. So now we're going to do uh, the ending, which I'm calling the coda here. If you've downloaded the tab, right on the coda, we have C. Which we've done before. And then the G, which we've done before. Then C again. And then we just lift up all of our fingers except for the first finger. Leave it down and that's a C chord with a D in the bass. And we go. And then on the recording he ends on a just a G bass note. But he's also got a little orchestra there and stuff. So if you are by yourself you could just go. Um, Sweet thing she can find All the sweet things they can find Hey, thanks for tuning in to this tutorial on Diary by David Gates. As always, please comment, ask questions, subscribe, tell your friends, 
and have fun. Thanks for watching Off the Record. Sweet thing.